Hello and welcome to History of the Day series of Triumph IAS. Let's start from the birth and death anniversary of the day 18th March. Kunzi Lal Dubey Kunzi Lal Dubey, 1896-1970, was an Indian independence activist, lawyer, educationist and politician from Madhya Pradesh. He was the first Vice-Chancellor of Rani Durgavati University and the Chancellor of Nagpur University. He served as the first Speaker of Madhya Pradesh Legislative Assembly in 1956, as the Finance Minister of the State in 1967 and was the President of the Inter-University Board of India, Burma and Ceylon. The Government of India awarded him the third highest civilian honour of the Padma Bhushan in 1964 for his contributions to the society. India Post issued a commemorative stamp on Dubai in 1996. Augustus D. Morgan, Indian-English mathematician and academic. Augustus D. Morgan was a British mathematician and logician who was born on 27 June 1806 in Madurai, India, and died on 18 March 1871 in London, England. D. Morgan made significant contributions to various areas of mathematics, including algebra, number theory, trigonometry, and calculus. He also played a key role in the development of mathematical logic, particularly in the areas of symbolic logic and the algebra of logic. One of his most famous contributions is D. Morgan's laws, which describe the relationship between logical conjunction and disjunction. These laws state that the negation of a conjunction is equivalent to the disjunction of the negations of its components, and the negation of a disjunction is equivalent to the conjunction of the negations of its components. D. Morgan was also a prominent educator, serving as the first professor of mathematics at the newly founded University of London from 1828 to 1831. He was a prolific writer, publishing numerous articles and books on mathematics and logic throughout his career. His work had a significant impact on the development of modern mathematics and logic. Now moving on important event of the day. Ordnance Factory Day Ordnance Factory Day is observed across India on 18th March to commemorate the foundation of the first Ordnance Factory at Kosipore near Kolkata in the year 1801. The erstwhile Ordnance Factories, which operated under the Ministry of Defence, MOD were responsible for supplying arms, ammunition and clothing to the country's armed forces. The Ordnance Factories in India are a group of organizations that are responsible for the production of arms, ammunition and other military equipment for the Indian armed forces. There are 41 Ordnance Factories in India, which are under the control of the Ordnance Factory Board, OFB, a government-owned corporation. Ordnance Factory Day is celebrated with great enthusiasm in all the Ordnance Factories across India. The day is marked with parades, cultural programs, and various other events to showcase the achievements and contributions of the Ordnance Factories to the country's defence. The day also provides an opportunity to recognise and appreciate the hard work and dedication of the employees of the Ordnance Factories who work tirelessly to produce quality products for the armed forces. Ordnance Factories Board Ordnance Factories Board had laid its foundation in the year of 1775 with headquarters in Ayud Bhavan, Kolkata. It is the oldest industrial organization managed by the Indian government and the world's largest production organization that is operated by the government. Significance The OFP was responsible for producing a variety of military equipment including small arms, explosives and propellants, ammunition and so on. The seven PSUs, Munitions India Limited, Mill, Armoured Vehicles Nigam Limited, AVNL, Troop Comforts Limited, TCL, Yantra India Limited, VIL, Gliders India Limited, GIL, Advanced Weapons and Equipment India Limited, Oil and India Optil Limited, IOL, have currently absorbed the functions of the previous 41 Ordnance Factories.